Hi guys, Heather Ballantyne here. So today I have a very exciting announcement. Grand Touring Automobiles is now selling Koenigsegg. And I'll be talking you through the Gamera and also the Yesco Absolute. I'm Heather Ballantyne, sales specialist and entrepreneur. Follow me and enjoy the ride. Arthur Power. Arthur's been selling Koenigsegg for how long now, Arthur? Two years. Wow, awesome. So he's going to walk me through the car, show me a few features. It's going to be very exciting. So, the Jumeirah. The Jumeirah means give more. So this car was originally developed in his head, Christian's head in the early 2000s, around 2001, 2002, when his son was born. And he wanted to create a car that could fit the whole family and then some. But back in the day, it was hard to fit, right? It's hard to yeah. fit a twin turbo V8 and four seats. The car just would not look good. Yeah. So they've been working on the engine, the ninth generation free valve technology engine that has managed, that they've managed to package into a two liter, three cylinder, 600 horsepower motor that is extremely small and sits in the back. And that paired to the three uh, electric motors has given the car enough horsepower, 1700 horsepower, to propel the car and fit four people with luggage space. And I saw where he didn't want to go fully electric because he wanted the sound. He likes the electric, he gets it, but he does not want to go all the way there yet. He just doesn't yeah. need to. The engine technology out there that they're developing can cope with everything needed. So this engine runs on type 2 biofuel, mm -hmm. so it can run on ethanol, on alcohol, on E85, on pump gas, wow. you name it. On volcano fuel, you, you <laughs> name it. Everything but diesel. But okay. because of the electronic valves that are on the top, it can actually figure out what's what. So you can fill the tank half with alcohol, half with pump gas, all good. The wow. Car it out. So I'm going to sit in this. Um, anything you, you know, you tell people when they're first sitting in the Gamera? No, just drop your foot. You know, it's like any. Yeah. Yeah. I guess that for any. Yeah, there you go. Oh, it's actually really comfortable. Yeah. I so love you can the be, steering wheel. You're like you're way the far back, right? Yeah. You can you can move it all the way forward. Somebody behind you, like I can sit behind you quite comfortably. Yeah, this is really far for me. I wouldn't technically sit this far back. So that would actually be where where I would drive. Yeah, I have an absolute ton of leg room. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm stretched. It's That's good. amazing. It's good. So all of my clients with really tall kids, this is perfect. I mean, the the rear fits full adults, so you can be six eight and, and be comfortable. It's got Isofix in the back, so you, if you've got kids, child seats, all that, no problem. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Turn the steering wheel. Oh, I love so that. So that gyro stays completely flat the whole yeah, time. Yeah, that's really so cool. It's, it's never, um, yes. your view is never never broken from it. Have you um, had the opportunity to be in it in motion? No, no. I, I think this is just so cool. I'd have to just get used to this, but it's yes. so futuristic. I love it. It is. And these mirrors, I know this is becoming more and more popular. Yeah, but. so those mirrors, good point. The mirrors are fully cameras at this point. Mm -hmm. uh, for North American homologation, there will be uh, mirrors that actually get stuck on top that you'll mm -hmm. be able to still use the cameras through, one-way mirrors, mm -hmm. um, but they will be removable. So once the rules change, you just pop it off and you're good to And go. this like levitating that's 360. Your, that's your dash cam. Dash cam, security, it levitates and it's constantly turning. It looks a little bit like the Death Star. <laughs> yeah, so if someone touches the car while you're oh, away wow. from it, it'll start recording. It'll be constantly recording everything. I saw on a video these cup holders are supposed to be hot cold. Correct. Is that true? The car has eight cup holders. Too hot, too cold in the front, too hot, too cold in the rear. Wow. On the rear, on the production model, there will be more space. There'll okay. be bigger cup holders. Awesome. Yeah. Wow, I love this screen. Yeah. This is amazing. Full um, smart cruise control, lane assist, rear, you know, blind spot assist, all that. Nice. And then these doors, they're two meter, 215 mils. Yes. So they'll have sensors all around them. So if you have a smaller garage or something like that, it won't hit. It'll it's gonna stop. It'll sense it. Yeah, exactly. It'll sense it. Amazing. Same with the bottom. If you're up to a curb, it'll sense it. It'll stop. Oh. So let's say you're two people in the car and the mm -hmm. door decides to 
stop like this because you're too short, because the, dog, the ceiling's too short. Mm -hmm. It'll actually let the person in the back get out because it senses you're there. And then as soon as that person's out, it'll actually loop, push the back seat, the front seat, all the way back. Oh, wow. So that you can get in. It's no, really right. incredible how spacious it is. I mean, it's so spacious. Yeah, yeah no B-pillar. These seats have been crash tested individually. Wow, and so. I love this glass roof. It gives you that yeah. even more of an open feel. Unfortunately, this one you can't, it won't be a convertible or Targa. Yeah, um, but, but still. But still, it is a very it's airy It's a beautiful, cabin. like, panoramic exactly. all the way back. I love that. Yeah. So what's the trunk space like? Massive, let me show you. <laughs> I gotta ask, I'm a girl, right? We like to take our stuff. You have kids, right? I have one. Awesome. And so, he yeah. loves cars. Oh my goodness, so much room. So spot for three bits of travel wow. luggage. And there's one spot in the front as well. All so right, sorry, but I'm gonna leave the Lambo at home when I have to take <laughs> stuff because, oh my God. You can really uh, yeah. you can take your whole Tons wardrobe in there. Tons of space. And you have Amazing. the little tiny friendly giant engine in there. Mm. It's beautiful. And the Akakovic that. exhausts that they'll be tuning to figure out exactly how they want to make it sound. Yes. And you see the little lip? I do. That's for flames. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm falling in love. I love it. Amazing. And there's also room in the front, right? Also room in the front. Okay. And this can be custom made, right? So if you have a larger, larger bag, you yeah. can make it a little bit bigger so it can fit. Oh, yeah. well that's nice. And the cars, of course, all wheel drive all-wheel steering, all-wheel torque vectoring. Which is perfect for our weather, It's Canada. It's the, Christian describes it as the have your cake and eat it too car. Mm -hmm. So you can go to the track in the morning, pick up your kids on the way home, go do some groceries, and then go at night. It can do it all. I love it. All we need to come up with to own one of these is? 1.8. 1.8 US, guys. So this is pretty awesome, this massive wiper right in the center. Yeah, yeah. Um, is there a reason to go with that sort of design element? Uh, mostly packaging, right? Where would they put it? It'll mm -hmm. never look good. So True. that looks the best. It is very jet fighter. Mm -hmm. And especially when you're doing top speeds, it won't jitter around. Well, so the design is incredible. I love it. Um, I think my clients are going to love it. This is just so awesome to have this type of power, yeah. but be so practical as well. Exactly, exactly. And fun fact as well, this car will do zero to 400 to zero, and you can get out of the car by the time a Bugatti Veyron will get to 400. Wow. And it'll do zero to 400 to zero at the same time, and you can stop the car at the same time as a Bugatti Chiron will get to 400. All right, well, we also sell those, so. <laughs> <laughs> we won't brag too much about that, but that is amazing. I love it. All right, guys, so we cannot ignore this beauty. Yeah. It's the Yesco Absolute. Yesco Absolute. It will be the fastest car in the world. Wow. And you know that 100%. That's a pretty we're bold pretty, statement. We're pretty confident. <laughs> yeah, we already have the race drivers, uh, the, the test drivers taking bets and who, who wants to do the record. We yeah. just have to find the, uh, the right space. It's incredible, wow. Yeah. I love yeah. all of it's this. All sleek. This is going to be their last high-speed chase. They, uh, they'll, they'll do this one and they'll say that's it. That's, it's, enough is enough. Yeah. yeah. Wow. They don't need to do anything more. So what's the, what's the stats on this, the horsepower? 1,600 the... horsepower on E85, uh, rear wheel drive. It has the light speed transmission, which okay. is a nine speed transmission. Wow. Think of it as a bicycle transmission where yeah. you have four here and 11 here and okay. whatnot. It's not a double clutch. You don't go five, four, three, two, one. Oh, you okay. can go from first to fifth. You can go fifth wow. to first oh, instantly. Wow. And the torque fills, fills it in in between. Yeah. So you can be cruising on the highway at low RPM and top gear, click it, and you're instantly going Oh my God, <laughs> I can't even imagine. Yeah. I wanna walk around it, it's so beautiful. And this is a prototype, right? This is, ju this is just a show car. I mean, production will be this, but yeah. they're already testing the uh, pre-production car. Just because we can't see the interior. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is so aggressive and beautiful. Exactly, so that's for stability and also to reduce drag. Does that give you like 
lateral force as well? A little bit. It keeps it, I mean, when you're going 500 kilometers an hour, yeah. it helps it keep going straight. Wow. But this car, you can actually, the way their suspension set up with the triplex, you can actually be zero, put your foot on the gas, not be touching the steering wheel, go up to 200, and then put your foot on the brake, go down to zero, and the car won't move. The I car can't even on. imagine. Yeah. Wow, well, it's incredible. Thank you so much. Yeah, sure. All right, guys, I'm so glad Arthur gave us his time and we were able to dive deeper into this amazing car, the Gamera. As always, if you'd like to know more about Koenigsegg or any of the brands we sell, be sure to make an appointment with me at Grand Touring Automobiles in Vaughan. Thanks for watching my video, guys. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and don't forget to hit that like button. I'll be releasing new videos every week and I can't wait to have you along for the journey.